Good evening everyone. After a long time we came back with a easy recipe of a noodle, a curry scented Maggi noodle. The Maggi is from Nestle. Some chopped carrots, some fine sliced green beans, chopped onions, white onion, curry leaf, ketchup, chili flakes, sea salt, bit of turmeric and two eggs. This is all you needed for a quick noodle. It's good for if your kids love Indian spices and it's easy for a snack time. So start with a deep pan, a bit of refined oil. Once the oil is hot, put some curry leaves, some onions. Don't need that to be really hot, just to sweat the uh, vegetables so the flavor is infused. And then you going to cook along with the noodle in water. Once it's slightly sweated, put a bit of chili flakes. I'm just putting a pinch. If you like more spicy, you can put it more. Or if you don't want to put it, it's up to you. A pinch of turmeric and a two packet of Maggi spice, the spice mix. This is a curry flavored spice mix. The second packet. Mix it. few drops of tomato ketchup, let's say one tablespoon, so mix everything together. Now we add one and a half cup of water, let's say like 300 ml. Yeah. Now we give it a boil. Increase your fire. Now you can test the seasoning whether the salt is enough. If you feel the salt is less in the mix, you can add you can add a bit more salt. So now you can just put the noodle. I need to keep the noodle as long as possible, that's why I'm not breaking up. And now we can use the fire to let it simmer. Once all the water is absorbed, you can test the noodle has been cooked. It should break like easily. And if you need more cooked or a bit more very soft for the kid, you can add a bit more water. Otherwise, this is a perfect texture or the consistency. Keep it a bit moist. And now we do the fried egg. Take a shallow non-stick pan, a bit of oil. The oil is not for preventing from sticking, but just to give that fried effect from for the egg. For keeping a perfect shape of the egg, it's better to break it in a bowl and then slowly drop it. If you want the yolk should be on close, you can just push it, bring it close and just hold it there. To cook it faster, you can just break in between to allow the egg white to flow down and cook it faster. Once the white is cooked perfectly, you can sprinkle a bit of sea salt on top.
feel like a bit spicy, season it with pepper. So now it's ready to serve. So once it's done, just the noodle is done, just slide over your fried egg. And that's it, it's ready to consume.